a publisher's rant, a checklist of items. Assuming you've read my rants on articles, you may want a checklist of items to consider for future articles. I am at your service. Checklist This checklist is going to be short and to the point. Remember, I'm lazy. Go back and read the original article if you need more information. 1. Headlines, keyword phrases should always be the first words. No exceptions. 2. First paragraph, no more than 38 words. 2-3 to three short sentences with the keywords from your headline included near the beginning. 3. No one-sentence paragraphs. 4. Cut up long sentences into shorter ones. If a sentence is over two lines, it can be cut down. 5. Linking an article, don't. Just do it in the byline. 6. Body headlines, break up the article with headlines in the body. Just keep them short and capitalize the first letter of each word. 7. Last paragraph, sum up the point of your article. Don't include links or a plea to go to your site. Use the byline for your begging. I do. 8. Bylines, keep them under four lines. Try to include the keyword phrases you're using on your site. If you are linking to an internal page of the site, use the keywords on that page not your home page. 8. Stinking Guidelines Is that too much to ask? I think not. Besides, I've already had laser surgery and can't afford a second session of smelling my eyeballs smoke. Please follow them. If you do, I will publish your articles and so will others. Despite the tone of these articles, I am trying to help you get more bang for your buck with your articles. Okay. I am also trying to make my life easier, but there isn't any reason why we can't both benefit. If you want to get published more often, follow these guidelines. Publishers, webmasters and editors will love you. The again, I could be wrong. Okay. Occasionally you can use one-sentence paragraphs. Just not very often. Content produced and distributed by All Super Info. All rights reserved.